<sighs> After a very, very shady defeat last night with the San Francisco 49ers, the Dak Prescott showed his true colors again. Two years in a row, two defeats in a row by the San Francisco 49ers. Anyway, we're gonna start off Monday with this refrigerator removal that I just knocked out. That was 45 bucks. Uh, here's the great thing about it. I'm about three miles away from the hot tub removal. So this was a pit stop before I get to the hot tub removal. Now let's talk about that hot tub removal because it's only me today. But I will tell you, I have called on to my boy, Jose, another junk removal service to come out and help me out. Um, and he agreed. He's going to meet me there at 10.30. It is 9.10 right now. I think what I'm going to do is go in the backyard and start beating the hell out of that hot tub. And just like, get it ready. I have nothing else to do until the next jobs come up. And I got my Milwaukee Blades. I bought the 5-pack. The Milwaukee Blade 5-pack. I usually buy the 20-pack of this. But they didn't have any. So that was kind of awkward. I just decided to get this. And you know what? Let's go to that hot tub. Hot tub removal. Hi, I'm removing the hot tub? Yes, you are. Okay, cool. Uh, is it this side or this side? This side. You want to take a look before? Yeah, I'm going to look right now. Yeah. Here's okay. the acid. This, this, even this lid's got water in it. <coughs> I'm actually thinking of uh, lifting the hot tub and just rolling it on the truck. Since there's gonna be like a handful of us, I think that's our best option. I've never really done it that way. But hell, I'll give it a shot. Uh, we're out here doing a hot tub removal. Got my boy Jose. Jose, ho hold on, I'll help you out. I'll help you out, you don't have to kill yourself. And uh, we're gonna lift this. We're gonna try this. This is gonna be a first attempt ever. I've done this before, but it was this was on a, like a hill, bro. It was on a hill. And I backed up. And then we flipped it on the easy. But I've never tried to lift one onto the back of this truck, ever. So we'll give that a shot. Okay guys, uh, we're here, we're live. Jose, what's the idea, brother? What's up? No, I don't think we need to take that off. No? No, we just put it right here. Aquí lo All right. ¿Se me entiende? What do you think, Jose? What, what, what's your chances of us getting this thing and pushing it up there? I think we need to put it sideways. No, no, no. Let's do. We get this. We lean it here. Then we just. Huh? It won't be too high. Nah, not on the truck. Yeah, let's. <laughs> He's not wasting any time. Jose was. Look at it. Look what we did. I did it by myself. Nobody else. <sighs> Riding dirty. Hot tub removal. 300 bucks right there. Booyah. I did it. Jose? Other than you throwing the deuces, can you say something about it? Uh, 
I won money on the 49ers last night. Oh, okay. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Let's not talk about that shit. Let's, all right. I'm still hurt about it. How long did it really take us, to be honest? Uh, five minutes. From there to here? I would say five minutes. I think we thought more about it than we actually worked on it. Yeah. Yeah. But uh, I told him, let's try to lift it, and it worked. We I saved honestly, a lot of time. We yeah. saved a lot of time. We saved like 20, 30 minutes. We that good show. We would have to clean up afterwards. Hell yeah. All that insulation and shit. Hell yeah. All right. We're out of here, guys. I'll talk to you in a few. Uh, I got a few more jobs to get to. I'll record. Bye-bye. All righty. That was cool. So I called up Jose uh, yesterday on our group chat, our junk removal group chat. We have about 22 companies on our group chat and they're all local, we all know each other. So I called him up yesterday, I sent him a text and he said he'd help out. He'd have to go do an estimate in the morning around nine and then he can meet me at the house around 10.30. But he actually showed up at 9.30. So whatever he had to do in the morning, he got it done quick and then had it over here. So we knocked this out and honestly, it took us about five minutes to do the hot tub. We loaded it to the truck and it was done. I think what happened is that we chatted more than we did anything. So it took us a little longer to do the hot tub. So uh, again, it's about 42 degrees. It's kind of cool, cold. Uh, this morning it was like 28. It was freezing. There was ice on my windshield, but the weather's really actually turned out pretty decent now. So it's not so bad. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go and pick up a fridge in Dallas right now, and then I gotta go pick up a mattress in Cockrell Hill. And that's how my day will probably end right there, okay? So I'll see y'all in a few minutes. Yo, this has to be one of the easiest easiest mattress removals I ever picked up. First of all, let me tell you, this mattress was six minutes away from my location. Second of all, I went upstairs. It's a really light mattress. Look, I pick it up with one hand. Look, it's really light. Second of all, I went to the second floor of this building. There was this old man who ordered, I mean, really old. And uh, he was just cool to talk to. We were talking about the Cowboys getting our... <sighs> Butt whooped yesterday. It doesn't matter. I'm not gonna cry. I'm not gonna cry about that. Uh, anyway, um, yeah. So able to finish this and do it really quick. Anyway, uh, I dragged it down the hallway, and there it is, man. Easy schmeezy. That's it, guys. So I picked up a refrigerator early this morning. I picked up that huge, huge hot tub right there. Check that out. Dang. And then I picked up that mattress. And then something bad happened. I had two other two other refrigerators to pick up. I gave them to Jose, two fridges and one mattress. Well, in my truck, I changed the fuel filter on my truck and it broke down on me. After changing the fuel filter, I couldn't get it started, so I didn't want to cancel the other jobs. So what I ended up doing was giving him the jobs and he, uh, I want to tell him thank you for helping me out. He did two refrigerators and one mattress for me. So about $170, no, $190 could have been my money but I messed up. Enjoy my videos. Don't forget to subscribe. Tell your friends about my videos. I'll talk to you later.